Hey, what up YouTube and welcome back to the long dark. We finally made it out of Muskeg and we are back in Mystery Lake for a stint. We have some things to do, but first we need some food. We're running low very quickly. We might even be completely out and today we're going to look to rectify that situation. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you do, drop a like. It helps me out very, very much. And with the intro out of the way, let's get started. I'm going to grab this last torch and we're going to take a cooking pot. It is the next day here. Let's take these teas, not put out that torch. It is the following morning. I've spent a chunk of the morning kind of getting uh, just getting some teas brewed and actually woke up to a bit of a blizzard, which just ended. So we are going to make our trek over to the camp office now. We're going to be a little bit smelly. I want to take this with me. I will leave those waters. These are cured, and these four rabbit pelts are cured, which is great. I'm going to take these with me. Those are not cured, but all of these birch saplings cured overnight and a little bit this morning, so that's great. I did pull the guts out of those two rabbits, um, and that's, I think, everything here. I'll leave one of these because it's good to have one. This mag lens, I guess I should take it if we're going to hub... If we're going to hub over there, then we should just take it. There's no real reason to keep anything other than, like, food and wood here. Um, I don't see why I would want to have the mag lens over here. Like, what is the point? I'm going to take a tea to keep warm. And we're going to top off our water. And it's right there. And we're going to head out this door and uh, make our way over to... The camp office. Now, I'm assuming, because I am a bit smelly here, we will attract some wolves. Uh, so I wanted to make sure I was stocked up on the torches. But we are out and on our way. Uh, it's a little bit snowy. We are a little bit heavy. What's our weight look like? Oh, actually, we're not quite as heavy as I thought we would, considering we're carrying everything that we own. And uh, I think with the two guts that we have and the maple, I believe one of the maples is done. I have to double check. I'm assuming there's probably at least a maple ready at the camp office. We should be able to get the bow crafted today. Uh, the only problem is food. I mean, that's our biggest hang up. I have pretty much eaten all of our food. I did was able to make a little bit of the, the bannock. Um... However, I don't have any more flour. Like, I have no other way to make bannock. So, that is the biggest concern I have. <laughs> um, it might be worth going to Mystery Lake. Uh, I'm sorry. It might be worth going to Milton. Uh, if we were to go to Milton... I want to put this down. This ain't going to hold... Can I light it? Uh, yeah, it's lighting. Okay. Uh, it's probably going to blow out, though. A trek to Milton might be worth it because I did have a chunk of food that was there. Uh, I, I couldn't carry it all back with us. So there's some... I know there's something there that we could eat. The other benefit is... Oh, there it goes. The other, I don't want to say benefit, but the other thing that we could do is venture to, like, um, Coastal Highway. Um, I think I've cleaned out all of the cattails. Well, I probably haven't gotten all the cattails around here. Hmm, I'm just trying to think where there could be some food. Did I ever actually skin the deer over by the um, rail car. I don't remember. That might be something we could check. I'm trying to think where the carcasses could be. You know, I don't know if I actually took the meat out of the one by the rail car. I don't feel like I did. I feel like I intended to, but I never did it. And then there's usually one over where the moose spawns by uh, the dam. 
uh, somewhere down there, either by like the lake, uh, the entry to the lake, or that hunting blind. There might even be two. So we might have another t uh, three, two to three corpses, or carcasses rather, that we can actually harvest. Uh, that would get us some food, which would be ideal. Because I do, I'm gonna, I mean, we want to get the bow going. Once we get the bow going, it's just killing a deer. And we'll be set on food for a while. I can eat as we harvest. I just need a good day to hunt. And even better if we can get a, the bow. And a deer spawns right outside of the, the cabin over here. Because then we can just kill them there and start a couple fires right outside in the in the snow. So that's kind of the quasi plan today. Let's put a couple hours into the bow and uh, keep our food going, or well, get some food and then and then try to get this bow crafted. If we can pull it off, maybe even get our bag ourselves our first kill. Hmm, I wonder what's up there. I just noticed that. That looks like it's navigatable. Like I could I could walk that up that probably. Huh. We'll have to check it out uh sometime in the near future. I may hang out in this region for a little while. Oh my god, you scared the hell out of me, man. <laughs> I almost walked right up to him. Can we not use this flare if I don't need to? If the wind was a little bit softer, I could maybe get the torch going. So far, he's just walking on me. Uh, I'll take that. Let's let's run. I don't think I can make it the whole way there. Okay. All right, he's just he's just following me. Yeah, see, there's a deer right there. Oh, this might be the answer to all of our problems. Because I might be able to let him kill the deer. And then I can scare him off with a torch and light a fire. We are going to attempt to make that happen right now. I need him to run that down. Can I go around him? Okay, you're after me, but go after the deer. Oh, don't run after- No, run away, deer. dancing and I don't want to dance with this guy. Well, I'm pretty sure pretty sure I can light a torch. All right, I feel a little bit better. Okay, can I run this deer back? I think I lost the wolf. No, don't go that way. No, the wrong direction, guy. Well, I botched that. There's no way now. All right, let's go. Let's go back. Damn, that sucks. It still might happen. He's over there. I wish I had, like, deer feed I could just put down let him come over. Let's get inside. Okay, we're at hyperthermic, or the risk at least. I'm gonna go just straight in. Let's go. Cool. Alright. So we're here. We're gonna drop all of our crap off. Yeah, look how much stuff we have in here. This is great. Uh, oh, 98. Let's put this one to the side so I don't lose it. 80, those are all 80s. These are cured, perfect. 
These are cured too, or one at least one is. And these rabbit pelts are pretty good. Let's eat a panic. Cool. Alright, let me uh drop these rabbit pelts. I'm just gonna pick them up and then drop them. Okay, cool. Those are good. Let's drop these. Okay. I didn't know they lose condition, too, like, while you're going. We can just get rid of that, too. Let's put it with our little pile. Um, let's drop these. 15% cured. Put them in here with this one. And then we can drop these over here, too. And I'm going to take this and two of these, and we're going to put them over here. Drop all of those, and then let's drop these and this. Oh, no, I need that gut. And can I get the other one? Okay, that one's fine. And let's get one more. Yeah, cured. Okay. And then... I don't know which one is which. I wish it... Oh, this has got to be cured, right? Because this is like a... Yeah, that's a fresher color. Okay. This darker one is, is how you tell. It's very slight, but it's how you tell. Okay. Cool. Put these away. Uh, these feathers. Yep, transfer all of them. Cool. And we're pretty much solid there. Uh, we will just go up here and drop off all these T's. And then I have to remember... Hey, yeah, we got a ton of stuff up here. Um, let's move this. I'm going to put all these T's down. And then I have to remember to move them when I cook. I'm going to keep the uh, fire starting book on us. Because I think getting that skill up next when we are trying to kill an hour is probably a good move. Uh, and then I want to do Wilderness Kitchen, because if we can get cooking level 5, uh, that would be great. But the with us going to be hunting soon, um, it's better to... There's no real reason to just crank that book right now, unless like we need to get over the edge. Because I can cook... If I cook a full deer, I think it'll probably push me over. How cold is it outside? It's pretty cold. Um, I don't know. I need to, I don't really want to heat up these teas and waste a fire right now. But yeah, let, you know what? That's, that's what we'll do. Let's go to the corpse. I'm going to keep calling it a corpse. Let's go to that deer carcass that's over here. The one that I don't think that I have harvested. Let's go harvest it. We're going to be a little cold, but we can warm up near the carcass. Uh, did I just drop all the sticks off, I guess is the question. Let's check. Uh, fire. Yeah, I got no wood. So um, we're going to need to pick up some sticks along the way. I think we'll grab these down here. And then I have my hatchet so worst case I can grab some but if I can I want to try to get is this the right tree I want to try to get the carcass let's get the meat off of it I'm not so worried about the hide right now no I don't need that one I need this one um not worried about the hide honestly um but I do want the meat I want to try to do a once around to go get the meat. If we can get a, like, I don't know, 10 pounds of meat on us, that should give us quite a decent amount of food to be able to go get the bow. And then from there, we can go hunting again. Or we can go hunting for the first time. But we can do some hunting and actually get something a little bit more sustainable. So it's right over here behind these two rail cars. 
And what I'll do is I'll start a fire next to the deer. And that'll warm us up. And let's just go ahead and light the torch now. Perfect. And I will actually go ahead and eat one of these. Just to keep us out of the red. And um, he should be right here. Right? Unless he's gone. Oh, here he is. Did I search this? Probably. Yeah. All right, cool. How much do you have? Give me something. All right, three. Three's not bad. We can handle three. Let's uh, go ahead and start this up. Oh, it would be nice to do that, but I don't have it. Um, no accelerant. I will leave that. I will probably need to make a couple tinder. Just looking at the fact that we only have one piece right now. And hopefully we don't have... Hopefully we don't fail to start this fire here. And it looks like we're pretty good. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and add some fuel. Yep, just add all five. Yep, cool. And I grabbed those T's, right? I know I put them down. Yeah, okay, I grabbed them. That's going to help us to warm back up while we're sitting over here. I'm going to grab a bunch of these here. If we need to, we can sleep in the trailers too. But I think it's probably a smart move to go kind of do the loop. I also need to go to the dam and get the simple tools. So we can repair one of the hacksaws. Uh, we need scrap and the simple tools or the quality tools or whichever ones we have uh, that are there to do that. But if I drink a tea here, harvest this deer, we should be pretty solid. It is getting darker than I thought. Uh, but it's the warmest part of the day, so all in all, we should be doing all right. Going to go here, and let's go ahead and let's drop one of these. Help restore our condition. And we'll drop another one if I could hit the right buttons. Oh, I would have just left my freaking hacksaw. <sighs> How much? Yeah, we're good on calories. Let's go ahead and do one. No. Let's go ahead and do a little bit. I'm still cold. Come on, cook. We'll drink that. That should warm us up. I'm really upset I left the freaking hacksaw. Uh, let's make sure all these are good. Hot, 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 and hot. 18 minutes. That'll be fine. Yep, harvest that. cook that and I'm gonna eat this pretty much right now yeah cool and then let's just get the rest of this uh, 14 minutes let's add some more and we'll get all of it oh that's six minutes okay Go ahead and cook this. Yep. And these are good. And then I think what we'll do... 30 minutes, 9, and 24. That's fine. Let's go out here and just break a couple of these down. 7 minutes for 3, or 10 minutes for 3. Let's do the 10. Cool. 
And we're cold again. That's okay. And we'll take that with us. It's got 10 minutes till it's ready. And uh, let's go ahead and break this torch down. Kind of need all the sticks I can get right now. Uh, where is it? It's in here? Yeah, let's go ahead. Break this down. Harvest. It's going to yield one. I'm just sitting here anyways on this fire, so we might as well just do it. Uh, pass the time here. Take it. And let's take the torch and pick these up. And let's head over towards the dam. We could spend the night in the dam if we wanted. Um, I just... The problem with that idea is that to stay warm in the dam, I would need to break down the crates. And that's going to consume calories. Uh, that's what we're kind of trying to save here. So if I'm breaking down crates for wood to keep warm all night, then we're not going to, we're going to be wasting kind of, we're going to be wasting the calories that I am trying to salvage right now. Um, however, if we stay in the trailers, we would be warm all night, but without a fire. So I think that's probably the better idea. It's foggy. The music's queuing up like we're going to get an aurora tonight, too. It just might be the track that's playing right now, but... If it's warning me that there could be an aurora tonight, I don't want to deal with an aurora in the dam. So, I think the dam is out. I think that tree there... No, those are... I think it's the tall birch ones. I know it's the skinny-ish white ones, like that, I think. Might be a birch tree that leaves the birch bark. I know I, like, just figured this out, too. Huh. I don't know. Uh, okay, this torch is running low. We should reset. And right here, I got four. This is a solid one, though. 36%. And there's moose marking, so I think down that way could be the moose. I know he was over on the other side of the bridge last time, so. Uh, he can definitely be in this area. Did I, oh, yeah, I started a fire here once. Forgot about that. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Let's go. Um, It's not too cold, so we can hold tight. Just trying to think what else we could do. I don't really want to go in the dark and try to get the meat. But it might be better to do that and work throughout the night and just work tired. Eat and then sleep and we're good. I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Um, I'll kind of play it by ear, I think. But I'm going to head this way, get over to the dam. I want to grab the tools two since we're over here and then hopefully not encounter that moose and we might just push it and go look for another carcass to get ourselves some food while we have the calories we have the energy and then maybe we go back to maybe we go back to the camp office and then work through the night and work tired. If that's the case, though, I need the light. The other option... I'm not seeing the moose. The other option... Is to sleep and just do it in the daylight in the morning. A lot of, lot of different choices. Let's see. There's another deer carcass. I mean, that's why we're here, right? And there's some uh, mushrooms... So maybe we go grab this guy here, start another fire, grab the mushrooms, we can make some more tea. I hope I have, do I have cooking pots on me? I don't think I do, I think I dropped all the stuff off. Some sticks, let's grab these. If 
I don't have a cooking pot, I can't make any more tea. Yeah, some mushrooms there, some mushrooms there. Oh, this torch is going to go out. And it just did. Dang it. Not paying attention. All right, let's light another one. Thank thankfully I have so many freaking matches. It's it's not it's not going to kill me. Okay, let's light that. And oh, I need to make that uh tinder too. No good. I'm going to reset this just to be safe. And now we're no longer we're, we're getting cold quick now. Oh, these torches all suck. This is the best torch I have. Okay, I got two more pieces of tinder here. We're gonna need to pull another couple torches off this fire. Worst case scenario, we head back. We head to the trailers and sleep there since we're out here in the dark. And uh, yeah, we could always do that instead of harvesting and then harvest this in the morning if we needed to. Put 40 on it. And then let's let him thaw for a minute. I'll take these. We're over here by the fire. We're good. Uh, let's drop a T. And do I have a cooking pot? I do not. So yeah, that's a problem. My pastime, I'm just going to drink this. That'll warm us up. Cool. That's going to help. And we can just maybe stock this a little bit more. And then how much do you have? Three pounds? Yeah, okay. We could do that. Not having a can on me is not good. <laughs> I need to get a can. Oh, I do have a cooking skillet. What the heck? That wasn't there a minute ago. Well then, let's go ahead and, uh, well, we're not going to cook that there, but we can cook a tea. Can you cook? What is going on? There it is. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Can we cook a tea? Yeah, let's cook that right there. Perfect. Let's get some more going. And we'll do another one. I need to check the fire too. We I know we put like an hour on it, so we should be good. All right, great. So there's that. Uh, we'll take that. Can we cook another one? Yes. Perfect. Let's go ahead and place these. Yep. And these two. I'm going to eat this. I wish that would warm me up. We're going to cook the next one. Uh, let's check the fire. 20 minutes. Yeah, let's add a little bit more. Let's cook another one. These are good. And then we're going to go ahead and harvest the rest of this. Seven minutes. another deer done and venison pie what does this do carry weight oh that's interesting I'm gonna do the rose hip pie actually how long does this take an hour four no okay cook that these are fine 
I'm gonna go ahead and drink that other tea that I made. And then we're gonna stock up this fire again. I'm gonna take a torch. And we're gonna go grab all the sticks I can find. We're gonna grab the reishis down here. I'm hoping the, uh, if, if the moose were to spawn over here. Does the fire deter him? I don't know. Like, I know the wolves and the bear are scared of it. But is the moose scared of it? Alright. Grab this here. This is a solid torch, too. Okay, we got those. Can I grab some cattails off the river here? Yes, I can, and I'll take these so we can get the tinder back. Anything over this way? Any more cattails? Anything? I don't see it. Is there... Sometimes there's a body over here, I think. Not today. Uh, is that... No, that was just grass. Okay. Um. Any more cattails? Just making sure I'm not overlooking anything. Nope, doesn't appear so. And how we doing? How we doing? Oh yeah, let's grab this. And some more sticks up here. No. Don't see it. Okay, cool. That's fine. Um, let's grab this. And how we doing? Okay, we'll take that. Did I have any more? I did not. Okay. Oh, let's take that. Let's pick that up. This up, this up, this up. Let's let us put this out. And then let's pull these. Cool. And maybe one more. Cool. Let's grab these mushrooms. And I think we might just go sleep. I don't know. Thing is, I'm kind of doing well. I don't like being in the fog, though. Let's check this out here. We're warm. I am got, got the teas. Like, there's kind of no reason to go. I mean, we're going to lose condition if we're tired. But it's so minimal at the same time. Mm, I'm torn. I Part of me wants to push. And the other part of me wants to go... Play it safe. Go to sleep. And get up in the morning. Though it's probably going to be like super cold. Uh, I don't know. Let's let's go get the tools that I need to get first. Can I go up this hill? No, I'm not even gonna. If I break my legs, I'm gonna be really upset. I hate it. It's annoying. I have eight sticks. Not a lot. I would like to get some more, but I don't want to sit out here and harvest them for ten minutes off the ground. We can cross the bridge, though, and then go grab the, um, the tools, and then we can grab, we can go sleep in the trailer. I think that'll probably do fine for us. We have a couple pieces of Bannock. We have a couple, um, ven pieces of venison. So we're good pretty much on calories. Maybe I want to just sleep. Instead of getting the tools. Get the tools in the morning. Yeah, I kind of want to do that. I just don't want to sit here and keep messing with these torches. Is that is that a good idea? Should I? Empty. Hmm. 
Uh, how many torches do I have? Three. This one's at 50%. That's not bad. Uh, alright. Let's... I think maybe we do go get the, the, uh, tools. And then come back out here. And then go to sleep. Because I'm not quite tired. I mean, I'm not all the way tired yet. I just want to make sure I sleep till the morning. And can we close this? Oh, I'm cold, though. We'll relight this. We got a really good torch here. 50%. That's a good pull. But we can just hightail it essentially in there and out. Oh, I could pull this too. I'm just playing a uh, cleanup lately. Getting all the torches we've left behind. And yeah, they're right here. Oh, wait, wait. Quality or simple? Let's just take them both. That's fine. I don't need those. There's another torch. Is there anything I left in these lockers? No. See, there's so much wood in here. But it would take so much, so many calories in order to get them, like to break that down. 122 calories, like I'm already hurting. So I think that we go, we're just going to go sleep in the trailers and then uh, see how things turn out to, in the morning. And then after that, maybe we'll go grab that other deer that I was talking about head back to the lake and then I'll probably call it a part there and we will get the crafting done in the next episode um, let's see how things play out though you never know with this game uh, I could meet a bear tomorrow and be done let's sleep let's go in here and sleep Yep, knew there was going to be an Aurora. Cool, we're right at the beginning of the day. Uh, let's... Ooh, we're almost out of water. I'll have to make some more. Let's look at the conditions of these. Yeah, let's eat the bannock. Alright, cool. And then I think maybe I will read just for a quick hour. Oh, no. Actually, we're going to harvest these. I want to carry all these torches. This, the moon ain't quite down yet either, so. We could spend a few minutes to do this. Our condition isn't full either. So, we haven't quite recovered everything we need to. And then hopefully for us, the moose isn't out today. I'd like for him to be out in a couple episodes from now. Uh, once I can kind of get an idea or strategy on how to kill him. Bagging a moose would be great because it's so much food. And I can get the hide. And then once we have the hide, we can work on the satchel. Oh, didn't want to use this one. Wanted to harvest it. Yeah. Alright, let's check the weather. It sounds windy, but not a blizzard. Yeah, it is a bit windy. Not a blizzard, though. And it's cold. I'm gonna grab these mushrooms. And then we may go back inside sleep for an hour to recover our, our warmth and then venture out uh, the purpose being that we'd be able to warm up without wasting another match starting another fire and then we can head over to that other corpse down that way um, and see what we find 
And then I can, because I would rather just start the fire once I get down there, especially since I only have three torches. I'd rather just start the fire over next to the carcass and, and heat up that way. I don't mind if I get, if I lose cold. So yeah, let's sleep for an hour. It should recover our warmth. Yeah, so we're back. And then, should I eat? Uh, the wind died down too, which is good. I wish we, like, burned calories just a tad bit slower. It would be much nicer if we could, like, if I could fill up. Uh, there's another, there's another set of mushrooms here. Keeping my eyes peeled for that moose. I'll grab them. Should have grabbed them before. But I'd rather have them. I don't venture out this way very often, so... Just looking, making sure he's not around. Um, and if he is, we'll just kind of avoid him with like a wide berth. But we just want to be cautious because he's faster than me for sure. I would he I feel like I would hear him though, like huffing around and and stuff. So I think we're good. But this is actually a really wide area for him to spawn. Like I didn't realize. Like, there's another moose marking. There's a bunch up by the uh, road up there. And then there's birch saplings over here, I think, too. Uh, I mean, at least I think they can spawn in. Uh, Dennis is over here. Let's see. Hey, man. You got anything for me? Candy bar? I'm kind of hungry. Grab the feather. All right. I heard something over there. I <laughs> don't know what I heard. Let's uh, run back here. I should actually... Yeah, let's... The wind's not blowing, so let's just keep this out. In case I get barked at. There's Yeah, there's... See, there's more birds. So either that's another body, or it's a um, carcass. I'm hoping it's the deer. Then we can harvest him too and get get a little bit more meat going. Because there's a hunting blind over here. Is that a deer? Yeah, that's a deer. Okay. And let's see. Down over here. Okay, it is a deer. Perfect. There's another deer over there. Let's go ahead and just start this fire. And uh, get this going. I probably should have checked it, right? Well, I mean, we need the fire anyway, so. Oh, I could have used the magnifying lens, too. Alright, just took a tea. Got this fire started. Started some water. Just drank up a tea. Uh, we got 42 minutes there. 12 minutes till it's boiled. Let's go ahead and grab some meat. Keep this going. We're pretty much going to clear out all the carcasses I can find in Mystery Lake today. So that we, we can get ready for hunting. Let's see. Let's go ahead and cook this. Alright, we're going to take that. We're going to do another... Actually, let's... No. Yeah, let's go ahead and cook another batch of water. These are fine. We're over here. I do want to go ahead and prepare some mushrooms. Oh, we're still cold, man. Even with the tea. Let's drink this. Will two teas do it for us? No, we're still losing. Oops, we're still losing cold. No, that needs to boil. Okay. Uh, no bueno. Let's go ahead and add some more here. Oh. 
And let's harvest another one. I mean, I'm good with the condition loss. We can recover most or all of it. Like, that's not too wor worrisome. Let's keep cooking this meat. 15 minutes till boiled. We got a couple teas there. Uh, I should have probably prepared a few mushrooms last night before I went out. It's just so cold today. We're, we've drank a tea and we're still at three haunches. I think that's what they're called, haunches, right? Let's check up here. Oh, another flare. I'll take it for sure. Cool. Anything else? Let's grab these. And this one. And this one. And then I'm going to grab these sticks over here. And we're heading back to the fire here. Let's grab this. How are we doing? That's got 11 minutes. Yep. 2. 34. Let's add some more fuel. I gotta get this fire hotter. Okay. That's gonna have to do. Take that. Cook. I can make another tea. And that's six minutes there. I'm still so cold, man. Jeez Louise. Uh, I want to craft another one. Oh, I'm warming up now. That's good. Take that. We got an hour. I'm going to drink this tea. Yeah, drink that. And we'll make another one. Cook. Yeah. And I'm going to harvest this. Okay, we're finally warming up for the day. Alright, that's fine. And we're going to cook this now. And then I'm going to do another one. Can I cook another one? No. 32 minutes. I have 50. How are we doing on water? I can't see because of warming up benefit. Uh, ha no, we need another water going. Let's do that. Cook. Nope. Water. Yeah, we're going to cook that. And 48 minutes. And then let's harvest this. And then I'm going to try to do, as it's midday now, I'm going to try to do one more over, I feel like there's one by the mouth of the river generally. Yep, I'm gonna eat this. That's a solid chunk of, of uh, food, calories. Five minutes there, 33 minutes there. Let us place this here. Keep those going. Uh, that needs to go. Let's add a little bit more. Because I need to grab some more torches out of here. We're warm. Can I grab any other sticks? Oh, there's one I missed. And what's this? Seven minutes? Yeah, let's just break that down. Seven minutes. Just do it. Very good. Oh, we're cold again, dude. Got a couple there. Uh, 11 and 3. And I think there was one more. No, that was the last piece. Okay. I am going to spend a few minutes here. And we're going to prepare some mushrooms. Because I need to be ready to make more teas later if I can't make them now. Take that. And how long do we have? Let's go ahead and cook this. And uh, I'm going to drink this. 
And then I think I just picked one up. No, it was water. Okay. Well, we're warm. So we're going to go ahead and check the fire real quick. Yeah. We're going to go ahead and make these mushrooms. And then I'm going to see how many more we have left. Something's running across the... The deer was moving. Uh, we have... We can make eight more. And I think we can make two of those. Eleven minutes. Let's go ahead and add some sticks. Yep. And I'll leave all that there for now. Let's pull some torches. Alright, put that away. And do another one. I feel like I'm getting really, either really lucky on these torch pulls, or I have a better skill. I'm gonna pick that up too. Don't forget it. Uh huh. And one more. We're good. Let's get the heck out of here. Yeah, like a lot of these torch pulls lately have been like 40, 50%. Now, it's definitely possible that. Uh, maybe you get a better uh, with your fire starting skill. Perhaps the torch pulls are better. I don't know for certain. Um, but I'm noticing it. Like, either that or I've just had a really lucky streak. I'm gonna go up here. Uh, maybe that was a bad idea. Let's see. Uh, is there any way down? Oh, there's a rabbit. Hey, rabbit. Yeah, this wasn't ideal. Um, try not to break anything. Okay. That right, was manageable. Uh, let's grab these cattails. Yep, I'll take that too. Take this one as well. And so this riverway here comes out on the lake. Uh, like following around here. There's some cattails for sure and generally I believe there's like a, usually a deer carcass over this way. I don't know if these deer carcasses are guaranteed or if they're random. I feel like the one by the train cars is guaranteed for sure. The one by the broken lookout that one's guaranteed. I've never not seen those there when I've been there. This one by the river mouth uh, may be guaranteed too. Is he after me or did he have to go after that rabbit? Since the music didn't kick up, I think he went after that rabbit. He can have it. Honestly, I'm not going to go harvest it. I want the carcass. Yeah, he got it. Enjoy, Mr. Dog. Uh, okay, he's there. What is this here? Yeah, here's the deer carcass I was talking about. Two two uh, pounds. We could we could do this quick. I uh, would like to reset this torch though. Honestly. God, that's annoying. That is so loud. I guess we could take it since we're going to be cooking anyways. Oh no, give me that. Stinky. Um yeah, let's re let's start a fire over here. And yep. Get out of here, guy. Cool. And then I will drop that for now. Let's go ahead and start this fire. Uh, okay. I was trying to figure out what to do. Like, do I throw the torch? And then what if that doesn't work and this fire dies? Uh, 
Uh, what do we want? Oh, he ate all the meat. How long does this take? 40 minutes? Uh, I mean, I guess we'll take it with us. But I'm not, I mean, for 0.7 7 pounds, like, whatever. Oh, this guy is going to keep coming. Uh, yeah, throw that. And this is, yep, 40 minutes. 30 minutes. Let's just do it. I don't know why I didn't click. But yeah, we're going to do that. So I can cook both of them at the same time. And we can add a little bit more fuel here. Probably, yeah, 46 minutes. An hour. We're going to go ahead and cook this. And there's one more here. Great. We'll get those going. Oh no, this weather. No. This ain't good. These ain't gonna make it. Okay, well, let's get out of here. I didn't put the the pan down, right? Okay, let's, uh, let's get the hell out of here. Are any of these warm? No, that's what I get, man. Because I didn't... I should have heated up the teas. I hate you. You made me waste a torch. Or a flare, whatever the hell this is. I'm stinky, so that's the problem, too. He's on me, but... If he would have, uh... Pissed off because of the, um... Blizzard. That's the word for it. We'd be in a better spot. I feel like my, uh, I don't know if my game just lagged, but I feel like I just had a huge drop on condition. I don't know if it, it kind of caught in the corner of my eye. But I believe with that river there, if we go up and over here, this is the way back to camp office. So we did a big loop. I'll take these. Yep. Uh, we should be back at the camp office right over here. I'll leave those. I don't need a bunch of them. I'm a little upset I had to use this flare. I mean, it's nothing to do with. Uh, there's nothing I can do about it. But it kind of stinks. Mystery Lake. Yeah, I know. That's where we are. And the camp office should be right here. Alright, well, we accomplished what I set out to accomplish. We have the food. Would have been nice to get that one deer that was over here, because that would have been all of the food we needed. Let's go inside. Cool. This sucks that that's going to be so wasted, but nothing I can do about it. Got plenty of food though. So this that that's gonna come in handy for the next evening while we get all the crafting done. Alright, I just did a little bit of inventory management. I'm gonna grab one of these <laughs> so we don't ever forget them again. Uh and kind of just took a little bit of a survey on what we want to do for the next part because I'm going to end up calling it here. Um, I think for next time we are going to strive to try to get some of these clothes repaired. Uh, that's probably a factor in why we were so cold today. Um, I mean, it was obviously a little bit colder than tip than uh, normal, I guess. But I'm sure our clothing being a bit more as tattered as it is uh, played a factor. Uh, the other thing we're going to do is we are going to get the bow crafted. Uh, that is for sure. Uh, we basically, in order to craft the bow, it's going to be about six hours um, for the bow with the improvised knife. We went over that last time as well. But 6.5 hours. And then to get the arrows, 
Uh, we probably put a couple hours into some arrow shafts. Uh, we're getting three. I'd like to have at least nine um, with the bow. Twelve would be even better. Um, but so figure that's four, four hours there. And then each arrow, uh, I'm assuming this is for one, takes one and a half hours. So that's going to be kind of the, the hard part. Uh, I definitely want to get at least three. Uh, putting in 12 hours on these is probably going to have to happen over a couple episodes. Uh, but that's more or less the plan. We're definitely going to get the bow going. And we got to get at least three arrows. Um, yeah, at least. Maybe six. Six is probably even better. Uh, but we can definitely kind of do this over time. Um, it just kind of depends on how our food situation is. Uh, I've got a couple pieces of meat here I'm going to need to cook. And uh, we can also look to get skin this rabbit and get his stuff going so we can get some more stuff cured. Uh, but we have quite a little base going. Um, it's pretty, pretty exciting. I did put all the meat outside. So it can, uh, go bad slower. Uh, and this is perfect weather to get the crafting done. So that's going to do it for me. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please drop a like. It helps me out very, very much. And I will see you all in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.